Hi, my name's Trev Hutchings, and this is how to create a realistic sounding MIDI guitar in Cakewalk by BandLab. Right mouse click in the track header section. Then click on Insert Instrument. Now click on the Instrument drop list. And click on Cakewalk TTS 1. Then click on Create. Click on Piano 1 on Channel 1 on the TTS 1. Move the mouse cursor over Preset. Then move the mouse cursor over Guitar. And then click on Clean GT. Now click on the X icon. Next, right mouse click on the TTS1 track. Move the mouse cursor over View. Then click on Piano Roll View. Now add some notes. You can use the scroll bar to move the grid up and down. The keyboard on the left of the grid shows which note is on each row of the grid. First, I will add some single notes to D4 and A4. Then I will add a guitar style C chord, which is C4, E4, G4, C5, and E5. And also add a guitar style G chord, which is G3, D4, G4, B4, and G5. You can drag the end of the notes to change the length of the note. Next, I will click on the Zoom In icon. And then drag the beginning of each of the chord notes to create a guitar downstroke effect. This will make the chords sound more realistic. But first, I need to click on the Snap icon to turn off the Snap to Grid function.
It sounds okay. But now let's add the Guitar Effects plugin. So click on the expand icon on the TTS1 track header. Then click on the plus icon in the effects section. Move the mouse cursor over Insert Audio Effects. Then move the mouse cursor over Guitar. And then click on TH3. Click on one of the bank names to see the bank presets. Here I will click on TH3 Inspired. Then double click on a preset to load it. Here I will double click on Airy Chords. Use the scroll bar to see more presets. Here I will double click on Syncopated Lead. Once you have chosen a preset, click on the X icon. If you enjoyed this video, do give us a thumbs up and click on that subscribe button. Cheers.